We all know and love Bermuda for the beaches, but did you know that it's got this amazing cave structure that has been in the making for about 100 million years or so? We're in Cathedral Cave, where plenty of the teams come and take a dip in the cool blue waters for a little recovery. Now, onto the serious business of what happens in the show today. If you missed Troy Lockyer's very impressive soda can magic trick on our broadcast in round two, luckily we captured it and now you can just enjoy it, either for the first time or just be spooked out for the second. Okay, let's go for the can trick. Show us the can trick. Yeah, yeah, sure. um, can we get two cans, please? Yeah, yeah. I'll come over to so we come over here. Okay. Um, okay, so with this, we're actually gonna, so we've got these two cans, we've got a Coca-Cola and we've got a ginger beer, yeah? Yeah. What I want you to do is choose whichever one you want. Ginger beer, okay? And what I want you to do is just shake it as hard as you can. As much as you want to do. Okay. Okay. And what I want you to do is, so a lot of magic is to do and be able to take a card, move it somewhere else, like, you know, pick a card and it, it goes somewhere else. What I'm gonna try and do is actually gonna take the, uh, the fizziness and pass it onto that can. Okay, so you've just shaken that up, yeah? I take the fizziness and actually put it into the can. You can do it again. Take the fizziness, put it in. Try a third time. And put it in. Do you think that's uh, I've done the work, I've done the job? I don't understand how, but okay, Try obviously. Op open that ginger beer. You just shook that up as much as you wanted to. It doesn't fizz, yeah? Wow. You might want to stand back. See, it's really important to make sure I don't shake this. <laughs> and now I have Coca Cola in my hair. I wasn't kidding about the water. So, speaking of the water, we had it coming our way from seemingly all directions on day one of round two. I filmed a little day in the life diary to give you a full view of what covering the World 10 series is really like. First at breakfast. Hey guys! Good morning. Hello. Ready? 100%. Meet Greg, my partner in crime. Proper windy. Alex Payne just getting stuck into some lunch. Well deserved. When I got here, I thought this whistling noise at night was made by some sort of nocturnal bird. It's a tiny little tree frog. Thank you. Water is constantly dripping from the ceiling here and the water rises with the tide. So many of these caves in Bermuda are only accessible with scuba gear. And this is one of many, many on the island. Um, and as you can tell, we haven't only been working. I've been busy being a nerd. And um, the rest of us have been getting out there, getting stuck in, playing some rugby, over to Rob Vickerman's lovely daughter, Amy. I'm Amy Vickerman, and we're at Horsey Beach playing a bit of pictures. We're the Barbarians, nice to meet. I think Team, team Vickerman's Heath and Payne I think we're doing a pretty good job of, of keeping the opposition on their toes, frankly. Did you guys really win? We went with like five back-to-back -back games. We killed it. Like, no one could touch us, literally. Fun and games off the pitch as well. Now, discipline is incredibly important. Phoenix coach Bram van Straten was caught dick of the day because he, uh, well, did a kicking demonstration that wasn't all that convincing and his team decided to hold him to it. He got to pass the dick of the day hat on a little earlier. Okay guys, um, the, this will be the, uh, I think the third of the day. Fourth. Uh, fourth. Fourth one. Okay, yeah. so a really special award. Um, 
and today it goes to a, a guy that um, got a red card and played for the London Royals. Um, can we just make sure that he uh, comes forward, Ziggy? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and I'll do the honours. Congratulations. Uh, wear this with pride, buddy. Yeah. Uh, welcome to the of the day. Pride. Uh, uh, maybe a, a little little speech. Nah. Please speech. Let's go. Speech. Let's go. Speech. speech. Come on. Speech. Speech. Be like a royal. It's a, it's a great honour to wear this. Thank you. There you go. Enjoy. <laughs> Cheers, guys. So I don't know if you noticed uh, the day before when coach was uh, busy doing some kicks for poles uh, to show you guys exactly how it's done. How many kicks did he get over? Do you remember? I think it was zero out of four, wasn't it? Zero yeah. out of four, boys? Yeah. yeah. So that's why uh, coach managed to wear that lovely hat uh, the whole day yesterday. Well done, coach. Congrats. Thanks, Patrick. Uh, really appreciate that. Um, Let's give him a round of applause, guys. <laughs> I'm proud of myself. <laughs> So, don't be a dick. tell a friend about World Team Series, keep following and keep using that hashtag WTS2020.